Jacksonville, Florida, as Georgia senior Sony Michel saw holes open up against Florida, he kept the goal simple. Gotta hit it, Michel said. Don't hesitate. Michel and the Bulldogs 80, 50 SEC DIDNT hesitate to punish Florida on the ground in a 427 win over the Gators 34-33 on Saturday. A year after Florida held Nick Chubb, Michel and company to 21 rushing yards on 19 attempts, the Bulldogs torched the Gators for 292 yards and four scores, led by Michel's 137 yards and two touchdowns. Georgia racked up 132 yards and two scores, one from Michel and Chubb, in the first quarter. They finished the first half up 210 with 167 yards on the ground. Some of that, Georgia coach Kirby Smart said, is because Florida has changed. They didnt have some of the same guys up front that they had last year, Smart said. They've still got good players up front, they've got a really good player in number 93 Tavon Bryan, he's one of the hardest guys to block in college football. It says a lot about what our guys were able to do to improve, it says a lot that they respect Jake from when you make him respect him with some throws. I felt like the wideouts are making some plays to loosen things up. But all that, second year in the system, offensive line improvement, good backs. Georgia went to Chubb early, opening the game with two consecutive handoffs into the senior. From completed a screen pass to Dondre Swift, who took it for a 39-yard gain. Chubb capped the opening drive with a six-yard score. Chubb took his fourth carry of the first quarter 16 yards to start a drive that ended with Frum finding Javin Wims on a 17-yard touchdown. Frum was 4 of 7 for 101 yards and a touchdown with one interception. Mickel's first carry went for a loss, but he took an attempt on the next drive 74 yards for a touchdown. It was one yard shy of his career long, a 75-yard scoring touchdown against Troy in 2014. It was the longest scoring run of the season for Georgia, and longest since Chubb scored on an 83-yard run against Alabama in 2015. Michel added another long touchdown in the third quarter when he sprinted 45 yards to put the Bulldogs up 280. Chubb finished with 78 yards on 13 carries with a touchdown. Sophomore Elijah Holyfield added a 39-yard touchdown run in the fourth quarter. Chubb is now the fifth leading rusher in SEC history with 4,189 rushing yards. He is one spot behind Auburn's Bo Jackson, who finished his career with 4,303 rushing yards. Michel now has 3,637 all-purpose yards, seventh all-time in Georgia history. The SEC is a non-rushing league, Smart said. It is hard to run the ball in the SEC. For those two young men to do that, I think it speaks volumes to them and their careers and the previous staff here and our staff because those guys work hard to get that and those things don't come easy.